Hello, my beautiful, beautiful, beautiful people. I have an Ipsy bag and I have a birch box. I'm going to compare the two because I have to finally say goodbye to one of them. And I've made my decision. I've had many, many, many. I'm going down to grab it. No, no, no. I've had many wonderful months of birch box. Yes, I have. But I've only had a couple of months of my beautiful pink Ipsy bag. And Ipsy bag has kicked birch box butt. It has taken birch box. And it's been like, pow, kicked your ass, birch box. It did. What can I say? It did. I can't keep both because I have this obsession with monthly subscription boxes. And I have to chill it out. I cannot get too many because I cannot afford too many. And I don't need all of these samples and stuff. I mean, it gets to be to the point where you have too many samples and you just cannot try them all. It's ridiculous. So they say. But anyways. I got my last month of Birchbox and Ipsy and decided this month I would have to pick because I just have to. So Birchbox, like you saw, has been cut to the curb. I'm going to show you what's in my July Birchbox and what's inside my Ipsy glam bag and I'm going to show you the differences so that you can see why I chose what I chose and so you could just kind of get the feel if you are thinking about ordering one or thinking about canceling one, I don't know, just get the feel of what I'm talking about, okay? So, my birch box in these boxes. I don't care for the box. Ipsy bag, got it down when they give you makeup bags instead of a box because this is not like a box that I can, what am I going to do with it? I've been getting birch box for two years. I mean, I know you can really reuse these to no end and that's the green thing to do, but really, am I going to stack them to my ceiling? No, I don't have very much space, so I'm not keeping all my birch boxes. Throw them in the recycling. So of course, here we go, pink paper like always, and paper to tell you what's on it. I am very unimpressed this month, July. Birchbox, July, has been one of the worst months ever, which has made me really say, yes, it's getting canceled. So probably I'll probably cancel it when I'm done making this video. Anyways, this is the little paper that shows you what you have on it, and it tells you all of the things and the prices and all that. You probably already know that, I'm sure. I may not go into too much detail, but one of the samples, the first sample, which I think is so cheapo, is this one. I don't know how to say this. It's called Kodali. Kodali? Kodali? I have no idea. That's the one. It's Divine Legs. The full size is $38. It's a tinted mo it's a tinted lotion that makes your legs glow. It's supposed to stay on there and won't rub off. Apply to legs in a circular motion. It might look dark, but the formula blends in, so they say. But I'm telling you, this is a very small sample if it's supposed to be for your legs. I mean, maybe I can do, like, the bottom of my legs and leave the top of my legs look like pasty white. I don't think that would work either. So it says Divine Legs. Your legs will look like they went on vacation. However, with this sample size, my leg is going to look like it went on vacation. The other one's going to look like it stayed at home. Not cool. Don't know what I'm going to do with this. But anyways, that's one of their samples. The second sample, which I don't think is too bad, is this Curl Keeper. I would have liked it to been... I don't like these containers. I understand they're green. They are green. Better than plastic and all that. But still. I mean, the plastic ones I could recycle. These I just throw in the garbage. I guess they're biodegradable. It makes no sense. Whatever. But... I would have rather have it in like a little container that I can close because there's a lot of product in this. It's a full ounce. So seriously, nobody's using a full ounce of product on their hair. If you do, you're going to look a mess. So it, you just open it and then use it and then you have to like leave it on your cup. I don't know. I wish it came into something that I can close. But anyways, this is a treatment. It contains no silicone. It rinses out of your hair. It is frizz off. And as you can see, I might need this. This might come into handy. The full size is only $10. Only $10. I know that could be a little bit steep for some people, but I don't think that's that bad for like a whole big thing of curl for stuff for your hair because you only use a little bit and blah, 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 so whatever. So I'm excited to try this, and if it works, I might actually buy it because I could really... I mean, it's the hottest week of the year. It's not been this hot since 1902. Cut me some slack. Next... Vivant skincare. Vi I can never pronounce things right, and sometimes I pronounce things on these videos, and then I look at it after I made the video, and I'm like, "Am I stupid? How did I pronounce that?" Like skin, the Iceland skin cream. When I made a video before, I called it Skyne. It's skin, really. Skyne. Hello. Anyways, not the point. Just bear with me here. It is a green tea antioxidant cleanser, so it's like a little face cleanser, little, very little, and a little like spray bottle. I don't know. 
I'm interested to try it, but I don't think I'd buy this because it's $29.50 and for a face wash that's a little bit steep for my taste. Whatever. It's an all-over face and body. Oh, it's also a body cleanser. It's a face and body cleanser packed with antioxidant-rich green tea and grapeseed extract. Double task by massaging into face and body in the shower. I don't know about something body and face. I don't know. I feel more comfortable using a body wash and a face wash. That's separate. It's the same thing. I feel the same way about the shampoo, body washes, and what else is it? Like, it's like body wash. Like the pure, pure, like the philosophy stuff. You know, it's like shampoo. I Oh my god. Shampoo and body wash. And I don't even know what else. Like three things in one. I just have a problem with that. I don't know. I can't use three things in one. I'm just funny. Anyways, off the subject again. And of course you get these past few months maybe a little bit more than a few months, they've been adding in these little things. So, I mean, they're putting a box inside a box, and then they're putting little cartons inside of those. So we're talking a lot of paper here, people. Hello. But anyways, it says, this month's we're loving fashion favorite Tibby. Tibby? Tibby? Tibby, New York? I don't know. And is... They're designed an exclusive pouch for Birch Box. Perfect as a makeup bag or cute clutch. You could pick it up for $28 or you get it free with a $65 purchase at Birchbox. So I'll just leave this here so you can like pause it if you want to and read it. And if you want to buy it, you can go buy it. Go get it. Tell me how it is. But inside of this, and this is the last of my Birchbox, is two green bobby pins. I guess it goes with my outfit, but kind of big for bobby pins. Is it just me or do they look like they should be on like paper clips or something? I don't know. I'm not too fond of them. And then a Pure Minerals, oh my, I'm sweating like a pig, Pure Minerals CC Cream, which is cool, it's a decent size, and light, thank God it's the right color. I'll put it on here so you can see. There you go, see, rub it in a little bit. CC Cream, so that's all we need is BB, CC, all this, you know, next will be DD Cream, and EE Cream, and when we make it to FF Cream, we'll talk about it then. But that's rubbed in. I don't know if you can see the difference. Whatevs. That's my birch box. I'm not pleased with it. What do you think about it? Because I don't like it very much. So I'm canceling. Because I'm cheap. And I love my Ipsy bag. And I'm just so beyond pleased with this. So we're going on to so last but not least. The bomb. Okay. Of course they give you this. And there's all these little like sales. So if you like something in their box. You get sales. Who doesn't love to sale? Come on, let's be for real. Um, you get 20% off the meter. You get a free gift with benefit. Free gift with purchase from benefit. And other good stuff like that. Into the goodies. I love Ipsy Bag because it comes in a bag. It doesn't come in like boxes and boxes and boxes. And like you have a box inside of a box with a package inside of that box. And then you got to go and open that package and then open more boxes to get into the products. It's just ridiculous. So instead you get a bag full of stuff. And they're not like little cheapo samples like Birch Box. It's like really good stuff. I'm really happy with this. So I'm going to show you. This is the bag. Plastic clear. I think this is a perfect summer bag. It's made good too. It's not like one of those really cheapy, cheapy, cheapy plastic bags that you see like this. Made horribly. It's made pretty good. And this will come in handy because the water can slide off of it. So it's good for the beach or the pool or anything like that. And then the first little thing in here I was so thrilled about because I wanted to buy these palettes and I've been being cheapo cheapo and not buying it and I don't have anything from BH Cosmetics. So it's this. It's the California collection and it's just a little sample, little sample, it's a little sample of them and it just has one shadow from each palette. So those are the palettes up top, obviously I'm sure most people have seen them. And then you have Hollywood, San Francisco, and Malibu. Three eyeshadows. It's so cute. I love that. Another thing that I thought was a really good deal is this pop. You get a full size pop lip crayon. It's the Pouty Pop Crayon. And it's in Fuchsia Flirt. And it just rolls up and it rolls down. And there you go. It's a little bit like. It really is a total Barbie pink. And it's funny because I was watching Stila Kiss's video because I love Stila Kiss's videos. And she said the same. She got the same one and she says it's like a Barbie pink. And it, Right before I watched that video, I opened my bag, and I was like, this is totally Barbie pink. So, great minds think alike, what can I say? Next, big sexy hair, weatherproof. And I was a little bit upset by this because I kind of sneak peeked and cheated and looked on the Ipsy. 
website to see what I would get. And they had this or they had a beach spray. And I've been wanting to try one of those salty beach sprays on my hair, even though it probably doesn't need it. Actually, I think needs humidity resistant spray more. So Ipsy, I think you know me better than I know myself because this humidity resistant spray will go good with my Birchbox humidity anti-frizz cream. But I probably really need this more than I realize. Hopefully it works good. Um, one of the other things is the Kula. Kula Mineral Sunscreen. I was a little bit disappointed by this, too. I know I'm a spoiled brat, but the reason why is because I saw the other sample that was... Because Ipsy will give you usually the same things, but on some things it will be different. So, like, everybody gets a lip product, everybody gets the eyeshadows, but not everybody gets this. Some people will get the beach spray instead. Not everybody gets this. Some people will get the tinted one. This is not tinted. And the tinted one was in the scent rose, and that's why I wanted to try it, because I wanted to smell the rose. But then I watched... It being swatched and I'm like oh I'm happy I didn't get the tinted one because that tinted one is a funny looking color that wouldn't go on my face so this clear one is actually better so again ipsy you've done me good this time last but not least there is more can you believe all of that great stuff and for only ten dollars the same price as birch box really people tell me who's winning now come on last salt air roll-on perfume oh holy guacamole cannoli holy moly this stuff, it's Demeter, and it smells, oh my god, it smells like a resort on a horse, I don't even know, it smells so good, I love this, it is summery, it smells so unique, I can't even, I don't even know how to explain this, but it smells really good, so that was my Ipsy bag, the perfume, the humidity spray, Barbie lip color, three eyeshadows, and a sunscreen. Really? Ipsy, you've outdone yourself. I love you. Thank you for having such a wonderful service for $10 a month. Barchbox, it's been nice. It's been a good two years. I've tried, found, and had some amazing products from you, but now it's time to say farewell. We've had our time together. Tell me what you think. If you've gotten this far into this, and you Tell me what you think. Tell me which box you like better. Tell me what you've got on your bird. If you got Birchbox, what'd you get this month? I don't know. Subscribe hit like always makes me smile and I hope everybody's having a wonderful time a wonderful wet summer and a wonderful life and that's that that's it love you all bye bye